It's an honor and a privilege to be presenting this award to such a kind, genuine, and all-round wonderful human being. In spite of the fact that she is now undeniably, kind of has been for a while, kind of a big deal, uh, she is also one of the most humble and gracious people I have ever met. I was very lucky to work with her on the electrical life of Louis Wayne and to witness her magic firsthand, but from Wolf Hall to The Crown to First Man to many more, including the upcoming series of A Very British Scandal. She is an extraordinary talent who always brings depth and complexity and her own unique brand of mischief and charisma to every character she plays. Full disclosure, I haven't seen A Very British Scandal, uh, but I think we can safely assume that that will still apply. She is an open heart on and off the screen, uh, and in every role she takes on, there is a groundedness, a humanity, and also a deep relatability, even somehow when that role is literally the Queen of England. Uh, <laughs> Claire Foy. Uh, I'm so excited to see what you go on to do with the rest of your career. I have no doubt that you will achieve many great and remarkable things. But for now, thank you and congratulations. You are Harper's Actress of the Year. That was too nice. I told him not to be too nice, and that was way too nice. Um, thank you so much for having me, Harper's Bazaar. Thank you so much, Lydia, and everyone in this room. Um, it's such an honor to be here, and I've never felt more inadequate in my entire life. And there's lots of pieces of paper on here from other people, which I might steal, <laughs> which would be really useful. Um, but it's a real honor, and I'm so, so humbled. I've absolutely done nothing um, to further the course of humanity in any way. <laughs> Um, so I'm just so grateful to be here. So thank you so much for having me. Um, I think there's so much work to do, isn't there? I think we all know that. And I know that in my industry about giving women opportunity and equality and support. But evenings like this give me a lot of hope. And uh, people like Will give me an awful lot of hope as well. So that's good, isn't it? Um, there's only one person that I want to dedicate this to. And she's going to be mortified. And that's my sister. Gemma Matthews Nefoy, who uh, Elena will agree is the best person alive, basically. And um, thank God for her, really, because basically she taught me not only how to be a human being, but every single day teaches me how to be a woman and a mother and alive with a heart and integrity and humor and genius, which is so undiscovered. So I encourage you to meet her. She's at table number six. Um, and <laughs> This is basically, oh, and also, Eric, thanks for taking my photograph. You're welcome. He made me say that. Um, but mainly for my sister, thank you so much for having me. And, and have an amazing evening. What a triumph. Thank you. Thank you.